Imagine Dragons has partnered with Bethesda to create a song called Children of the Sky to celebrate the release of Starfield. But is there a hidden meaning behind the song? This isn't Bethesda's first time using Children of the Sky for one of their games. It dates back to The Elder Scrolls III Morrowind, where you can find a book titled Children of the Sky. In fact, this book is also in Oblivion, Skyrim, and The Elder Scrolls Online. So, what does this all mean? Well, the contents of the book detail aspects of Nordic culture and a focus on Thum and its ties to Akavir. In the book, we find out that Nords consider themselves to be the Children of the Sky, as they refer to Skyrim as the throat of the world where the sky used the north winds to form them. The Nords see themselves as outsiders and invaders to this land, almost like they were placed here by other forces. They drive to conquer and rule and feel no kinship to the species that lived there prior. They have ties to the Akaviri, which are a race from Akavir, the land of the dragons. Now, what does this all mean for Starfield? I think it is likely drawing comparisons that as humans traveling through space to different planets, we are outsiders and invaders to the natural species and flora that reign supreme, much like the Nords of Skyrim. Will we take over those worlds just as the Nords did, or will we live peacefully with the life we find? We will find out soon enough.